Thanks. Growing concerns tonight over a bird flu outbreak in Henry County. Several birds were found dead at Noah's Ark Animal Sanctuary. That's in Locust Grove. Well, right now, the Georgia Department of Agriculture is on site testing other birds. CBS 46's Don Shipman is live in Henry County for us. Right, right outside of that facility. Uh, Don, what have you learned today? Well, I've learned that they are testing and they are cleaning. In fact, I saw a vehicle just leave the gates here and before they left the premises, they were hosing that vehicle down. The gates are closed here and there's a sign on the gate that says the facility is closed to the public. And then if you look through the gates, you can see that white trailer right there and then all of those white vehicles members of the different state and federal agencies that are actually on scene. So we're talking about the Georgia Department of Agriculture, the Georgia Department of Natural Resources and the USDA are all here on the property. The facility is under quarantine. Noah's Ark is an animal sanctuary, a nonprofit that takes in exotic animals as well as farm animals, a lot of birds. Now, right now there are some 400 birds on site. Those state and federal agencies are testing those birds and wild birds in a two mile radius of the facility here after several birds at Noah's Ark died from avian flu. A representative with the Department of Ag told me that the facility noticed an unusual number of dead wild black vultures on their property last week, so they called in the state. The state did some testing and discovered those birds had avian flu. I talked with State Senator Emmanuel Jones, who's a member of the Henry County delegation. He says containing the virus is vital to Georgia's economy. Birds tend to be migratory, and this virus moves from one facility to the next, um, and it gets anywhere near our poultry producing facilities, it's gonna be a serious, serious problem and a major impact to the economy of our great state. And I did ask the Department of Ag how many birds tested positive for bird flu. They did not have a definitive number for me, but I'm told that as part of the decontamination process, many of the birds that are here in this sanctuary could be euthanized. Important to note that this is a bird disease. So the experts that I've been talking with say that there is minimal threat to people and or our pets. Live here in Henry County, Don Shipman, CBS 46.